I think they've got I will if I can in and the red lights are on and they're racing immediately. Well, Chief of the Clan, he cannoned out of the gates. And look at him go. He's going to cross them like they were nailed to the fence. Chief of the Clan went clear by two and a half. Settling down up to second was Pixie Rose. Leo Leo's prominent. They were followed by Grey Rock, Smoke Alarm, and diving up on the inside was Rose's Song, picking up a bit of ground. I Will If I Can's beyond midfield, followed by Evie Dropper, Taurinus a long way back with Bonham and Mateship. While the flying chief of the clan, he came up to the 450 metre marker half in front, but there's Leo Leo stalking him, and the two favourites are one, two, straightening up. They were followed by Pixie Rose, a clear third, Smoke Alarm to the outside from Rose's Song, and Grey Rock in the straight, chief of the clan in front, Leo Leo serving it up to him and there's six lengths in front of the rest at the 200 metres mark a two horse war Chief of the Clan kicking he beat off Leo Leo got a length in front Chief of the Clan and he's going to burn the candle at both ends Chief of the Clan went on to win in a ripping race beat Leo Leo a half now third is tight between Pixie Rose and Rose's Song then Bonham Smoke Alarm Grey Rock followed by Mateship then Torinus I will if I can, and Evie Droppers last in, and that was a horse race. Okay, there they were. Well, they declared it on. Have you seen a horse come out like that? She sprung the gates very quickly, the winner. And then Leo Leo was there a heartbeat later on his outside, and they just went at it from the time the gates opened. Sometimes puts them I think Nick Ollard's like got himself a pretty handy galloper here in Chief of the Clan. The he wins well for Richard Bensley. Leo Leo won't be a maiden for long if all goes to plan with her this prep. And in the tight photo for third it goes to six Pixie Rose ahead of seven Rose's Song. Eight, five, six and seven.